So good afternoon YouTube. Welcome back to the vlog. Welcome back to the video. Um, it's Friday afternoon. Finished work. It's coming up to three o'clock I think. Just hang on if I lean this way. Five past three. Just looking through into the kitchen. I'm um, going to get you set up on tripods and we're going to do an unboxing. I've, if I turn you around, flip that. I've got a coffee and the remains of Sarah's birthday cake. So I have coffee and cake to eat and drink. So let's get you set up and we'll get the unboxing done. So here's our package. I'm not quite sure how I'm going to do this so that I can actually get it so you can see hands free. I might be better to go back upstairs and then I can sit, set you up on my windowsill. I think we'll do that actually, we'll head upstairs. Okay, so I've got you balanced at the moment, up there. I've got the tripod balanced on top of the active route box that I opened the other day, on top of my Sony camera box that you actually been recorded on. So as I said this is this is from Cycle Power Meters what I showed you yesterday. New power meter we've got two part two packages here so first of all I'll just take the top one off. Um, I've used cycle power meters a lot over the sort of the previous years for power meters and accessories for power meters so it's cycleparameters.com Bob Tobin's company um, they're based in Rugby which is Warwickshire not too far away from me so the first section of this is just a new set of cleats so we've got in here a new set of Paratac cleats so the Paratac cleats for my P1 pedals so We've got a replacement parameter in here so that I will sell the P1 pedals. So those are to, to be sold with my old parameter. So there's my old one. If I just undo the box. So I've already taken these off the bike. I bought these in April 2017, I believe. Yep. 29th of April 2017. So I've put the old parameter P1 pedals dual sided in the washers and now wherever I've put them here I've got a new set of cleats, correct cleats to go in the apart from at the moment they won't fit in because of the packaging but I'll sort that, I'll open them and put them in there. So they're genuine power tap P1 pedal cleats. So let's just put that to one side for now. So where do we open it? Just need to find the edge and then we can slit the tape. Find the edge again. So we, here we go, in here we have a new box of, I'll get rid of the cardboard packing, the Favero, Asiomas and then the Duos. So the Duo mark there, so that's the box that the Duos come in. That's the size of the box for the P1 so much smaller. The reason I've gone for the Favio Favero Asiomas is because I re can recharge them and they are lighter and not as bulky as well. They look more like a normal pedal so again we've just got packaging and then let's open up and have a look at the pedals themselves. So they're actually stuck in So let's get tool set out of the drawer, pair of snips, and they're held in with just cable ties. So we'll snip those, put that away. So 
So yeah, the much sleeker resin body. That plate's not replaceable on these. The other thing that attracted me to the Favoros is when you look at the website and see what's available, you can get a lot more of the spurs. So the, the power taps, if you want to change the bearings or anything like that, you've got to send them back and get that all done and get it all recalibrated. With these, you can buy the bearings, you can buy the axles, you can buy lots of different things to fix yourself. You can't change this metal plate on the Asiomas. There's also no natural play in those at all, so the bearings, no movement. If I just get one of the P1s, so there's a P1, get the same pedal, so both left hand side. Noticeable weight difference, noticeably smaller. On the Paratat ones you can replace this metal plate, that does wear over thousands and thousands, or many tens of thousands of kilometres that will wear away. Obviously this bit's bigger, but that doesn't get in the way of anything. A lot slimmer. Metal body on the P1 resin body on the Asiomas but I've got quite a lot of look pedals that have got resin bodies I actually quite like the resin bodies because the light, lightweight and I've got a feeling you can get all the new body as well and everything but my main attraction to these was the fact that you recharge the batteries and you don't have to cha change them so I went out and did the, my last 100 mile ride before I did the Mad Her Sportif before I set off it said the battery was half full Run out halfway through. And the burrings on these, there's always been a bit of play in the burring, even from brand new. Which is fine, it's just how they are, it's just I don't like it. So I'm going to sell these and we're going to use these. So I could weigh them on the vlog if I just get you up now. There we are, that's better, isn't it? Now I'm talking to you. So I could weigh them on the vlog. But it's already been done before, all you need to do is go and search for Shane Miller, GP Llama, on um, YouTube and he's done an unboxing where he's compared the Asioma Duos to, if I, let's just block this off, a bit too light, too dark, so he's compared the Fervero Asiomas to the Paratap P1s, to the Garmin Vector 3s and to Dures, pardon me, Shimano Dures pedals. So yeah, looking forward to these, so I'm going to get them installed on the bike, get them set up, get them activated and I'm going to use them tonight because tonight I'm doing a Zwift race, 6pm, my last race for um, the Zwift Academy. Now I have got one other unboxing to show you wherever I've put it. That's rubbish, wherever I put the other one. Here it is. So I've had another parcel arrive. I had a message the other day from Mark Frost, Frosty, asking me for my address because he wanted to send me a package. So this arrived today at work and I've opened it and inside we have, you ready? Dun dun dun! Loads of Haribo! <laughs> so thank you Mark, there's a note in here, let's read what he's put, oh there's even more, there's another package there. Let's read what he's put. So, hello Duncan, I hope you're good and that the garden, on, garden party on Saturday went okay. I have these packets of Haribo for you as I don't eat them and I have been storing them up for a few weeks. They're all in date, so enjoy my friend and hopefully see you soon. Many thanks Mark Frost. Thank you Mark. <laughs> Brilliant, so I've had a new Delivery, okay, it wasn't from Wiggle. And I got Haribo. Okay, and it wasn't from Wiggle. Thank you, Mark. Another good point of the Favoros over the Paratops. As far as I'm aware, I might be wrong, 
apparently the Paratap P1s have got a claimed 1.5% accuracy. Asiomas with the updated firmware, 1%. So that was another reason. Thanks for watching. I'll get these installed on the bike, get them all set up, and I'll let you know how I get on. See you later. Thanks for watching.